So let's first read out our problem. The problem says the farmer has 30 chickens and rabbits all together. There are only 100 legs. Find the number of chickens and the number of rabbits the farmer has. Chicken has two wings and two legs. And what about rabbits? Rabbits have four legs, isn't it? Don't go for the accuracy of my twine. Let's use it in understanding our logic. So, chicken has two legs and rabbits have four legs, right? This is the fact, okay? So now, let's assume that all of them are chickens. If all are chickens, how many legs will we have altogether? So all 30 of them are chickens and each chicken has two legs. So there should be total 60 legs. But this 60 is less than 100. How much less? It is 40 less than 100. Isn't it? These 40 legs actually belonged to rabbits. So again, these 40 legs which are left over, we have to give them to rabbits because they need 4 legs. Right? And how many legs we have to give to each rabbit? Yes, we have to give 2 2 legs to each rabbit. Right? So number of rabbits will be? Yes, 40 divided by 2, that is 20. So there will be 20 rabbits and left over 30 minus 20, which will be equal to 10. These will be chickens, right? Because we have initially we have assumed that all of them are chickens and then we found out that that still 40 legs are there which we have not used, right? And since each rabbit has 4 legs, so we have to give 2-2 two, two legs to each animal to convert them from chickens to rabbits. So we got 40 divided by 2, that is 20 rabbits and 10 chickens. 